So you'll notice pretty quickly that today's video is a little different than normal. First, I should mention that the background gameplay footage is the main footage for today's video. It doesn't have audio because it was just recorded for use in the background of an upcoming achievement guide. So there's tons of noise and you know non-game sounds mixed in. But a couple games turned out to be amazing. So I wanted to make this short video. If we do more videos like this in the future, they'll probably have gameplay sound and music. Let me know if you like this type of highlight, and we'll include them on occasion if we get amazing gameplay while playing off stream for background footage. So this perpetual protection shaman was made to help us knock out the new Spit Hot Fire achievement for shamans, where we ultimately have to destroy 75 minions with perpetual flame. The first game is with us facing a token druid who did a pretty good job of cycling through the deck. If I were just about any other deck, the board the opponent is about to set up would be terrifying. But I was like, oh yeah, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> I mean, normally, if you see an opponent fill their entire board with glowflies on turn four, that's pretty scary. When I saw them pulling off the lightning blooms, I was like, oh no, are they going to arbor up and get out of range? But no, things just got better. But based on how this game played out, I'm tempted to say that Token Druid is the best matchup to face with this deck when you're working towards the achievement, as even Soul of the Forest tokens get decimated by Perpetual Flame. So this single flame took out 14 minions, overloading us for 14 mana, but fortunately our opponent had overloaded themselves as well. And now we pause for dramatic effect so that you can relish in the sheer insanity that is this amazing perpetual flame. It's just too good. <laughs> And also the animations take a really long time. <clears throat> but yeah. Alrighty. <laughs> so the deck does also include Moarg Artificers to make the opponent's minions easier to clear and Diligent Note Taker can help ensure we have additional Perpetual Flames to cast later on. Of course, Wand Maker, Venomous Scorpid, and Instructor Fireheart can also discover additional copies for us to use. And this deck has the typical Alakir Dream Nightmare combo finisher that was quite common before the mini set. And with a 58% win rate across 19 games, it's decently strong. Now, if we do do highlights like this in the future, I'll also talk a little more about what I was probably thinking during the gameplay going on in the background as it's happening, rather than just explaining the deck and, well, this kind of explanation. So in this current game, after we wiped out their amazing turn 4 play, they kept cycling through the deck looking for their next power play, and we worked on developing the pressure to finish them off. I mean. Killing 14 minions in a single turn with Perpetual Flame is probably enough to expect from a single game, right? But our opponent did hang in there and managed to pull out a pretty impressive board once more. Sadly, this time we didn't have Perpetual Flame to save us, so we had to settle for a double landslide with help from Diligent Note Taker. <clears throat> But yeah, I really wanted to share these games taking down a token druid and the following short clip, because I only recorded this short portion, of a survival of the fittest buffed clown druid. This deck will be featured in an upcoming guide with the remaining mini set class achievements once we finish the druid and demon hunter achievements. So look forward to that. So now once more, let's relish in what perpetual flame can do especially when empowered by a double Moarg and, you know, generating extra value thanks to uh, Diligent Note Taker does.
That's insane. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> Maniacal laughter aside, yes. Um, <clears throat> yeah. Anyways, that's it this time. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to tap that like button, smash that subscribe button, and share your thoughts in the comments below. We release videos here every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Also, if you enjoy experimenting live, check out our stream at twitch.tv forward slash ssalchemist. We currently stream on Saturdays and Sundays. There's a link to our Discord server in the description as well if you'd like to check it out. And remember, you're awesome. Thank you for watching and have an awesome day. Strength and honor. This is who we are.